Hey guys, it's okay to use your generator. You know, one of the funny things that we RVers all get in a really bad habit of sometimes is only trying to find places that have power, right? I mean, how many times do you call an RV resort and say, do you have 30 amp, do you have 50 amp? We forget that we have generators on these beautiful condos that take us all around the United States. <laughs> so I just wanted to do a quick little reminder of, hey guys, it's okay to use your generator. Guess what? We started last night, uh, we're down here in West Palm. Our friend has a wonderful golf resort that we are literally camping out on. Uh, this is actually the location for a new condo building. And we're really trying to consider talking our friend Don Perry of Jacob Companies into, could you not just turn this into a really cool RV resort at Banyan K? Right? Probably wouldn't make as much money as the condos will, but you know, it was worth an option. We tried it out. We do need more luxury resorts down here in Florida, that's for sure. But. We got here on Friday and the thing that was so funny is we were like, oh my God, we don't have a plug-in. And then Mike reminded me, we have a generator. They actually work, you guys. I know it takes up some of your diesel, but these generators work. Generator. Starts with a G. It's off right now. If you want to put it on auto gen, you push A, put it into run, and then it'll shut itself off. Correct. Wherever the blue is highlighted, that means it's off right now because we're plugged into shore power. If you wanted to put, unplug it and you was out in the boons and you needed a, the auto gen, then you go to auto gen and then it waits to start. And it's 80 degrees today. Sometimes we also get a little worried about, well, it's really hot outside and it's gonna be hard on the generator. That's what these things are built for. Just a friendly reminder every once in a while, it's okay to fire up that generator. Yeah, in the middle of the night, you feel it turning on a couple of times, but just think of it as a light little massage. That's RV life, right? Come on. A little light massage in the middle of the night when your generator pops on and off. It just makes glamping all that much better. You gotta love when you have good friends and their RVing friends are always looking for places to dry camp.